Now we've got our big bird. Hi, big bird, how are you? <laughs> Drop it right in there, you make your brine, get everybody in there. So, and then it's also it's like- so brilliant and easy. So I take like my fennel tops, I use right. fennels and stuff in right. to make my gravy and stuff. So take the tops, throw them right in there. You bought them, they're free. Right. A bunch of other herbs. <laughs> all your herbs, bunch exactly. Of herbs, uh, carrots, onion, celery, all aromatic stuff. And then you're like, but wait, I, this isn't gonna fit in my fridge. Well, you know what? Coolers keep things cold, so just put a bunch of ice in there. <laughs> we take our knife, and the first thing, how do you hold your knife? You pinch it between your thumb and forefinger and drop the other three fingers downtown, so you are really in control of this. And this is how you will be the most safe and the most agile. And <laughs> so then we have our rolly things and our fingers, and we're like, again, the low-tech solution. Let's just stabilize the whole issue. To cut off the non-hairy end, the root end, I like to call the hairy end. Leave that on. Cut off the stem end, and then cut it in half right through the middle, and you have a corner in which to peel it. Super speed demon. Yes. So then we make slices, and all the slices need to be the same size. Why? Like shapes and sizes. Uniformity. Mm -hmm. If things aren't uniform size, then they won't cook evenly. They so look, different cook times. This is why we leave the hairy end on. The onion, it holds everybody together. Look, it's cut, but it's together, but it's cut. <laughs> so one time through the middle like that, and then we go downtown. So it's like work over your garbage or thank you for coming bowl and just long smooth stripes like this and look at, voila, super speed demon. If you have a slow cooker, guess what? We just don't have to cook in it. We can keep stuff warm in it like That's our right. mashed It's like potato. a warming tray.